Hi, micro students. This is Professor Schimmeld, and I'd like to show you how to inoculate motility media uh, to test for bacterial motility and also how to inoculate a TSA plate to test for swarming. Uh, I am not using any live bacteria in this demonstration. That's why I don't have a coat or gloves on. All right, let's talk about motility media first. Uh, here is a tube of motility media. We call this a motility media deep, and it's a semi-solid media. Now, it contains an ingredient in it called tetrazoleum, and you don't need to remember the name tetrazoleum. I'm only telling you that because we add tetrazoleums uh, so that uh, as the bacteria grow in this media, um, the tetrazoleum will turn pink and that will make it easier to visualize and interpret our results after incubation. So this is a motility media deep and I will use my inoculating needle for that operation. So uh, let me go ahead and do that. So I would um, flame my needle, of course, until it glows orange. And remember, I don't have any live bacteria, uh, but let's pretend this TSA slant does have the organism uh, that you would be testing on it, all right? So then I would remove the cap, flame the lip of the tube, uh, very carefully go into the slant with my needle and remove just a little bit of the organism. I'm just very gently um, kind of scraping the surface of the uh, TSA slant to remove a little bit of the organism. Flame the lip of the tube again. Now I'm ready to pick up my motility media deep. Uh, same deal, remove the cap, flame the lip of the tube. And I'm only holding it like this so you can see. What I wanna do is I wanna stab straight in to the motility media and remove the needle. Uh, trying not to tear the uh, auger from side to side because that makes it difficult to interpret your results later. All right, that uh, tube of motility media is inoculated. I'm going to uh, flame my needle again. And I'm not gonna worry too much about the glowing orange because there's really no one on there. All right now, a uh, swarming plate. This is a TSA plate. Um, I would label on the bottom of the plate around the edges. And what I'm going to do is flame my loop. Let's just pretend it glowed orange. Remove a little bit of the test organism. Um, from the slant that Renee provided. All right, flame the lip of the tube again. And then what I'm gonna do with this plate is, I'm just gonna lift the lid enough to get in here and I'm just going to inoculate the organism in a circle in the center of the plate. That's it. Replace the lid, flame your uh, loop again, invert the plate, for incubation. We'll talk about how to interpret the results in, uh, in lab. Thanks for watching.